this is my short review of Dutch oven made by Bren Dani. This brand, Bren Dani. And uh, you can see that brand over there too. So um, I was shopping for different Dutch ovens. And I've seen Cousinart, I've seen uh, Smith and something else. I've seen Lodge, I've seen uh, some other ones. Uh, what can I say? Well, first of all, uh, this brand is not very common to see. Honestly, I went to many stores you cannot see that brand everywhere. Uh, if you look at uh, this, is like a small booklet uh, about how to take care of things. If you look at the booklet, it says 5.2 quarts. So this appeared to me. Uh, this brand is actually it says made in China. It does not say um, on Dutch oven, but but it says here on that booklet made in China. So appear, what appears to me, they are making this for Italian market, or for European market, and they don't change things. And uh, basically it's made for liters, but when you calculate it will be in quarts. So they put 5.2 quarts. So it's, it's not really made for American market. And now, if you look here, what's interesting, it says porcelain animal surface, lawn life. What I did like about this is a lawn life. You see? And uh, I don't think they make like false statement because uh, usually Italian quality and product is good. Products are good. So um, I would say, I doubt they would make like cheap and then put, put like long life. So um, the cover, the cover look like this, it has like a metal piece. So you can put inside of the oven and other side look like that. And I can tell that's pretty thick coating. That, that if you don't, if you cannot see through, that appears to be very thick, long lasting coating. Because I've seen other brands, uh, for some reason that appear to me like less coating or, or kind of more see-through. But this one is really, to cover cast iron, you really need to have a lot of coating like this. So you cannot see. It's like painting a black fender of the car. You need to have many coats in order it, it would look right. So inside look like this. It, it has very thick coating. You cannot see through. So I do believe this is long last. It has handles, kind of thinner ones. Um, well, I have big hands, but you can put four, four fingers. Four fingers you can put. Now, uh, most likely it will be hot. So if you use towels, kitchen towels, you can squeeze your fingers. Or if it's really thick, then you need to hold with three fingers. But my fingers are big, so three fingers or four fingers. Now, on the back, I did already cook one time. Uh, on the back, it says suitable for induction. Uh, so you can use this on electrical stoves. For electrical stove, the bottom should be extremely straight and smooth so it doesn't have the gap between the electrical stove and the pan. Many times 
pants will deform and the bottom is not gonna be sitting right it would be like certain gap and shaking possible so this should be pretty good you see it does not have round but it has certain kind of walls going like with certain angle and there's basically for electrical stove okay or for gas i'm using gas now what else hold on now when you have it was attached you see it says brand Brandani, Italy. Brandani, Italy. And it says cast iron. And it says premium quality. So that was kind of motivating factor for me. If they say premium quality. I don't think it's really false advertising. So I decided to go with that. And then another thing is if you look at this it says it says lightweight cast iron lightweight cast iron 30 percent lighter well that would be comparing to thick ones so like this la Crusade actually is thinner than normal so this would be thickness approximately of la Crusade for the french expensive model but uh, the same thickness I've seen on smaller cushion art. Smaller cushion art have the same thickness, but there are some some models of, of Dutch oven. They're a little bit thicker. Now, uh, very strange, but like I said, this look to me, it's made for European market, but I bought in the United States. Um, the manual, if you look at manual, it says in Celsius, English, but saying Celsius, it's not even uh, any other measurement. So if it is Celsius, it means it's, it's made for basically Europe or could be for Canada or Mexico, I don't know. But I bought here, I got actually a TJ Maxx. They only had two one like that size another one different shape and uh, i've seen it and the next day i thought maybe i should buy it and i go and i see one is gone already only this left so so cleaning they talk about cleaning the so cleaning basically suggested do not put hot uh, Dutch oven to cold water and start washing. Basically, wait for the temperature uh, to go down, then wash. It's kind of similar to uh, many walks, like like those. Uh, uh, you know, when you buy like Asian wok, uh, especially. Uh, you know those carbon steel those I had carbon steel they usually suggest uh, do not wash immediately after cooking because that that temperature changes between hot and cold can deform the wok so basically uh, this company I don't know maybe it's affecting the surface animal or, or affecting the cast iron or construction shape but they do not suggest after cooking when it's super hot put on the cold water and start, start washing um, so i'm not sure what language is that uh, probably it's Italian. I don't think it's Spanish. So basically, first part is in English and second is, I think it's Italian.
prima di utilizzare per la prima I don't think it's uh, Spanish so I think it's Italian so so first part is in English second Italian it does not appear to me Spanish maybe th this one is Spanish I'm not sure, but uh, it's very small kind of manual. Basically, they attach this one and this small manual. There's a the hole. They attach to the handle. That's how they're selling. Uh, I've seen online actually it's possible in the United States to buy that. Uh, and uh, like I said, this is 5.2 quarts. It looks like this. So it is maybe thinner than large, but it is it's not really thin. It's like La Crusade or like uh, Cousinard, the smaller the smaller cast iron models so once again like that like that if you put together well this has good edge it's quite good edge long one so for the steam probably that's pretty good it will seal pretty good <coughs> so all together look like this I think you can tell something, something is telling that's Italian. I don't know what shape or, you know, handles or design or something. Like uh, Italian, this ma mama, cookie, cooking, mama, grandma. Anyway, that's all I can say. I think it's a good alternative to anything you see on tv because on tv they usually say five or ten best they never have this brand but it's possible in the united states to buy it i've seen you you can buy online or oh, i got this at tj maxx in california have a nice day bye